last week. Um, gave up a long return um, on kickoff. Uh, gave up two long returns on punt, 18-yarder and a 17-yarder, which we struggled a little bit. Um, you know, but the one things that that really kind of frustrate you were the ones where you know you get 12 men on the field, the ones where you end up with 10 men on the field, and we end up getting a field goal block from that re that standpoint. Those are the ones that really frustrate you because those are, you know, those come down to almost. Uh, you know, it, it reflects on your coaching, you know what I'm saying? And that's the one thing that was frustrating about that. And so that's why I was more frustrated than that than I was, you know, some of the effort that, you know, I felt like we gave on punt and sometimes the effort I felt like we gave on kickoff. That we can fix, without a doubt. The other things can be fixed, you know, having more awareness. You know, I just thought that sometimes we got out there and just didn't have a whole lot of awareness, but that comes back to coaching. And I got to do a better job of that. When you look, you, you, you have a new kicker, you had an incumbent on the roster, and you, you, you chose a new guy. What, what was the decision process in choosing Jonathan Barnes? Uh, you know, it goes, you know, it's, it's a week-to-week -week thing, and those guys compete at all camp. It's not one of those things you go out there on a Saturday and you feel and you make that decision. You know, those are things that are done because it's, there's tangible evidence, you know, where it's, it's all measurable. And, and, and at that point in time, we felt like, you know, the kid had performed well. And, and the, you know, the, guy, the, the incumbent, you know, was coming off of one of those, you know, he was a little banged up during camp, and we just felt like that kid had a stronger leg, you know, last Saturday, and that's why we kicked him. Is there just, is, you're going to stick with, with Barnes throughout the season? Is that uh, the plan You right know, now? it's one of those things where we compete from week to week, you know, and it depends on, you know, who's feeling it that week and who's competing better and who has the better numbers. You know, it's not always that, you know what I'm saying, but, you know, we rely heavily on that. When you look, take a look at your corner, your corner group, how do you think they, they performed uh, Saturday against OU? Uh, you know, it's one of those things where uh, I felt like we could have tackled a little bit better on the edge. I felt like we could have set the edge of the defense a lot better than what we did. You know, they got on, on the edge a few times in the first play of the game. You know, um, they got there quickly. It's because we took, a, a, you know, we made a bad decision, you know, and um, it's one of those things where you have to just reinforce that, you know, you're not going to be Superman every play, you know, and, and make, you know, the spectacular play. Just make the play that we're asking you to make nothing more, nothing less. How, how have they responded to the coaching this week? Looking forward to, to ULL on Saturday. I think they've responded well. You know, our kids, you know, have always been in a position that they're going to compete week in and week out, you know, and they're going to respond how they've always responded. That's one thing about kids from Louisiana and East Texas that you get in Mississippi and Arkansas. That Those are kids that, you know, they have a tough mentality about them, you know, and it's one of those things where, you know, they take pride than their effort and their work habit, you know, so you never have to go out there and ask those kids to work. And so, you know, they, they've shown the resiliency to bounce back up after a loss like that, and I expect them to come out there and perform well this, this weekend. Do you ever foresee, like, possibly using two kickers, like, in a specialty way, like one for short distance, one for longer stuff? You see a lot of that in, in college these days. You see a lot of that in college these days. Um, you know, it may come down to that. That might be one of those things that we may consider right now. Um, you know, we, we've, we've gone with one kicker, but who's to say that, you know, somewhere down the line we may, you know, consider going with two kickers. I couldn't give you an answer, you know, yes or no at that right now.